Good morning, guys. Welcome to today. Yay. Today is Friday. Fun Friday. The girls are making breakfast. It is already late. Every morning, Gabby has been getting up, running down, doing chores, and then coming back up for school. So she's been saving us. I've been able to get some cleaning done. It's been awesome. I see the girls down there enjoying breakfast. Grilled cheese. Oh. Sophia is a grilled cheese enthusiast. What are you making for breakfast, Gabby? Pancakes. Pancakes. And she makes her own pancakes with this big, huge bag of flour. No, we need more flour. We need more flour? I thought we had oh. a bag. So, um, yeah, I think we have another bag. Get. So, anyways. I'm going to have a little mini one of these. Molly's going to have pancakes? Yeah. So, uh, Gabby is a pancake girl. Sophie is a grilled cheese girl. We are halfway through homeschool. I mean, not quite halfway. We are getting ready to do some language. Well, we are getting ready to do some language. But before today's video starts, I wanted to tell you something that we're going to be doing. Something super excited. Just an FYI, this video has not been sponsored by this company. Before this video gets started, I wanted to share with you guys something exciting that we're going to be doing. Starting September the 19th, the girls and I are going to begin a 30-day challenge. It's called the One Ride Away Challenge, and it's 30 days. 30 days to help transform your horse into everything you want them to be. This 30 day challenge is going to correct bad habits, build confidence, build a partnership with you and your horse, build confidence in your horse as well as yourself, and build a partnership. Ever since Gabby and Kaylee took that clinic this summer, I've been obsessed with finding new ways to drive us forward with our horses and our knowledge. And because we homeschool, this is gonna be right up our alley, but even for people who don't homeschool, this is something you can do in a very short amount of time and it's only 30 days. What I love about this program is that it only takes a few minutes. You watch a 20 minute video each day and then it has a workbook that you work through on your own. Um, so for us, being able to do this kind of on our own, watching the video, having the workbook that we can take to the barn with us, um, it's gonna, I, I feel, will really work for us. But for people who don't want to do it on their own, there's there's a Facebook page that you can join for support. How amazing though, if we could make a day by day group in the Facebook page, like that would be fun. I'm going to put a link to the challenge in the description box below so that you guys can check it out and see if it's something that you'd like to do. But if you do want to do it, I think we should do it together. I, the reason that I'm telling you guys about it is because I love getting advice from you guys. I love hanging out with you guys and I just thought it would be really fun if we could do this together and we could talk about it and it could be like a bit of a focus and part of our vlogs each day, how we share the things that we're doing in this course. Like I want to show you guys the things that we're doing. So so um, if we are all doing it together, I think it would be really fun. But anyway, if you're interested in the course, it starts September the 19th. I'll put the link in the description box below. It's 30 days. That's it. 30 days to a better relationship with your horse, better confidence for you, better confidence for your horse. Hopefully it's going to work for us. I'm excited to see who else takes it with us. Um, anyways, yeah. Now let's get back to the video. I forgot to mention that this works with any level of ride or any breed of horse at any discipline. So I know all of you guys can do this with us. Okay, so we are headed out. Guess where we're going? Guess where we're going? Just take a big, big guess. I'm gonna wait a few seconds while you guys guess. Guess where we're headed? Guess where our life has taken us to the other barn. Maybe it makes me wonder if being 15 minutes away is a bad thing because we have to go there all the time. Like we have to, we're always going there. But What's storms that hurt. See your more. Yeah, and storms hurt, so we have to take care of him. And I'm trying to get it done early today so that we can have the night to do fun stuff. Uh, Gabby's still doing school. It's almost lunchtime. Um, see, except for my next lesson with Brandon, because then I get to jump another oxer. So tell them about what happened in your lesson with Brandon. Um, I got to jump an oxer. She, she jumped a two-foot oxer. She's jumping two-foot verticals. Two-foot oxers. She, and it seems uh, like it's higher on Finn because he's a pony. Yeah, and do you feel like you're going really fast, or do you feel like you're going just normal? I like I'm going really fast, oh but like... I'm ready. I'm ready for Finn to take long. Zoom. Zoom. I'm going to rename you Zoom Girl. Zoomer well, Girl. Not that fast. She had to add more legs. Wait. Actually. Yeah, she could have probably... Uh, she doesn't use any leg. And that's why I said in our lesson yesterday with, with Sophie is that she is such a good horse because... He jumps well. He knows the speed he has to He go jumps to well go. all the time. Like he always jumps in such good form. Like he has he knows how to jump. Like the horse can jump. And so she just has to work on her, which is so once you get to the level that you're not afraid and you can just work on you. Oh my goodness, it's it's amazing. So anyway, we're gonna head to the barn and see you guys when we get there. Hi guys. Finn saw us. He was licking the salt lick. 
And then as soon as he saw us, he went over to tell Chino, Chino, get ready to run. Hi, buddy. How are you? Look what I have. I got treats in my pocket. You want some too? Where's Storm? That's concerning. Where's your troubled, where's your partner in crime? I know we can't be in the shelter. It's not raining. This is not, this is not good. Do you guys see Storm? Oh no. I might go with them today. Good boys for staying. You guys have no friends? You guys are each other's friends, huh? I'll come with you and we'll find Storm. Oh, look it. He's already taking a run for it. Uh-oh. Storm, look, Chino. Finn, look, I got more treats. Finn, treats. Look. Come here. Come here, Finn. Finn, I got treats. Here. Finn, are you leading us to Storm? Oh, what a sneaky little sucker. Oh, you should grab him while you can. Here's treats. Here. Hold the treats out for Finn. 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 Here, take the treats. Take the treats. Don't leave me to store. All right. Wait, I need treats. Crap. You should have taken a bucket. Here, Sophie, you want treats? Do I have a halter? Because I'll come get Chino. Okay. Sophie didn't even wear boots. Look at that. What a brat. All that we've ever done for him. And now he's just running off. I got Chino here. He's like, Chino's like, just keep feeding me the treats. Oh, look it. He's going to go for her. I kind of low key want to walk around in there though and see how pretty it is. Honestly, the thing I worried about most when we moved here was trying to catch our horses and it's turning into a reality like I'm sure Finn doesn't want to ride today and he's not gonna ride today because wait till you see the blessing him and Sophie had like keep bragging about it But it was unreal. I got a bucket All right, there's his lead rope. She knows such a good boy. He's such a partner. He's such a friend Having three horses is a pain in the butt. I'm not gonna lie and storm it's a pain in the butt, I'm not gonna lie. Oh! <laughs> Scared me. You made a new friend. Who was it? What color? Uh, I don't know. Was it a girl? I'm not sure. Just like with kids, I firmly believe the best gift that you can give them are friends. Like, I think horses need other horses, so I am happy that he's making friends. I just wish we could be his friends too. So we're here to groom them, get the mud off. Every day we've been washing their bell boots to get make sure they can Mud doesn't get sore on them, and uh, so why don't we all just brush a horse? Well, you know what Hi. The mud gets all the fussy parts, and the fussy part dries with the mud on it. Then it rubs. Yeah, rubs on him. Thanks for coming. Did you give him treats when he came? Yeah, only the three though. Wow, you remember me, Story you Boy. In your pocket. I will always give you lots of treats. I uh, don't give him any because I'm gonna be giving him the other treats. Yeah, his special treats. Yeah. So today we're not gonna ride because uh, Chino had a really rough lesson and Finn had a really rough lesson yesterday. I feel like we're at the age of really rough lessons, and I want to tell you guys, please try and be patient about Chino and his journey. It's awful watching him. I literally closed my eyes a few times during the lesson because. They have to get there, and, and the path sometimes is not pretty. Like, I know people who won't even show the journey to somewhere great because they're afraid that people are gonna condemn their path. So I just ask for you guys to be patient. We've done an amazing job with Storm, and Finn is coming along so well from where we used to be. We just need, Chino just needs his time. He just needs time and work, and you might disagree with how our trainers want us to do it. You might disagree with the things that we do, but please, was be patient and wait it out and I promise that there's gonna be improvement and change with him. That moment you move to a new barn and you take up the whole barn. We got horse number one, horse number two, and way up there we got Finny, horse number three. Finn is actually horse number one. I know. Storm is no. horse. Storm's number one, Finn's number two, Tina's number three. Yeah. 
I spy with my little eye a little baby sheep. There's a sheep here that was bottle fed and so it follows the owner around all the time and, and drinks from a bottle. It's already weaned. Oh. It's already weaned, but it still wants to buy. Oh my goodness, there's a whole bunch. <laughs> oh, hi. Gabby meets the sheep. Gabby almost caught a bird. Run, little sheep. I almost caught a bird. Oh my gosh. I out this window and it couldn't go out because the window was closed. Uh oh. <laughs> hey, kitty. Oh, kitty cat. I love kitties like that. That's like a variation of a orange a cat. Yeah, <laughs> a big winter cat. That's a big barn cat. He's fat. Looks like he's been eating lots of mice. Oh. So that's what Storm's leg looks like after we treat it. That's all we do is we just put powder on it. Yeah. Storm looks oh, like it. Actually, look at this though. Like that's what Sophie would look like with brown hair. But look at, put your hair next to his hair. Almost the exact same color of whiter. hair. Yeah, his is a little bit whiter. Because the owner here said that Storm does not look the least bit lame. Like, he doesn't look lame at all. He's, his cut is healing up really well. He runs and plays and does all the stuff in the field. So we're gonna run him around in the arena now that he's had like a little bit of time to heal up and see how he does. And then if he isn't lame, we're gonna start riding him again. We're gonna keep him, try and keep him in shape. Like the more, hey, dude, I don't have any more can, more treats. That was my hand. Yeah, I, this guy still doesn't feel loved. Like him and Gabby just have not connected yet. Like it's hard when you already have a horse that you love to the end of the earth. Like every day she tells me, I, I miss riding Storm. Like I, I want to ride him again. But God always has a plan and, and honestly, whoa. Back it up, dude. I honestly believe it that Gabby needs this time with Chino. Like I think that this time that she's having with Chino has been so important. They just need to get past this big hurdle. We put them back in the field. Better, cleaner, fresher. So, um, Storm's friend, um, he, Storm's friend came trotting up to Finn. So I quickly took Finn's halter off and, and ran. Out. <laughs> so imagine all along the only reason Storm has been misunderstood and not loved and not not and has not been in love with our other horses is because none of our horses fit him like what if he needs another the only horse. reason he doesn't fit in is because his friends are out there waiting for him this is what chino jumped last night oh he didn't jump this oxer no. oh good thing because that's wide she's just gonna do a little free lunge he might not oh we just want to see if he's lame we're not jumping, we're not doing anything crazy. Yeah, but he might buck because he's storm. No, this is storm on quiescence. This is storm. This is calm storm. Yeah. And he looked over at you. He's gonna buck me right So what do you think? How does he look? What is it how does he look? You he looks he... like he's loping. Yeah, he's a loper. I don't know. Does it look sore? Well, he's loping. Fiona would say it looks painful too because he's loping. <laughs> he looks fine. Well, we might start him out with some little trail rides or something easy. No jumping. While he heals up. Good boy. All right, let's put him away. Do you want to go follow him? Are you coming? Well, I want to one day soon. Do you want to go into like to uh, Tina and Finn? Those are our fat boys over there. Nothing against fat Not boys. Fat. No, but he's gonna be. Finn is. She don't never get fat when he was on the round Remember? But he also had a slow feeder around She's like, I don't want to walk in the mud. What a drama king. I know you aren't walking in the mud. No. He's finding the best possible. I know, I love that they do that. No, Storm. Storm. But then when you lead him, Storm thinks that you have the best route. 
So then he just follows directly. Look, oh, look, he did really not want to go in the mud. He slid, so he's yeah, like, there's a puddle there. Yeah. Right. I oh. It, it's mine. Be nice to our horses, Stormy. You're in the non-muddy spot, Ben. Go in the muddy spot. Go in the muddy spot. I, I'm not. the oldest here I deserve. So look, that's Holly. They're sisters. Look at how much more Molly has to grow. Like, not a lot, but still a lot. Like, she's still obviously a puppy. Get longer. Remember the last time we brought her? She was terrified of her. Now she's just friends. She's learned to behave a lot more around dogs. But look at they look exactly the same. Don't they look alike? The tricolor. Yeah. So for Molly's a tricolor and she's just and Holly's a black and white. So we are obviously at the tax store because this is what we're looking for right here. Oh wow, look at the colors, Gabby. No, other side. Do you not like these ones? Other I like side. these rubbery ones are thick. I like these. If I had a horse, then we'd get those. These are nice. Like feel how thick they are. I don't know if they'd uh if they would break those. So, uh, this is a, it needs to be a large. They, they look large. These are medium. Mm -hmm. And then these ones are. That's adorable. Alright, so we got one pair. That's cute. Pony. We need, need cob. Yeah. Alright, so large. Those are. Yeah, they're nice. They're for Finn, I mean, for Chino. And then we need. Oh, sorry. <laughs> so now Chino doesn't have two pairs, right? Storm needs a pair. Right. Chino has Storm. So he said two pairs each, and we have one pair, and they're Storms. So Chino just needs these to complete us first. We need two more for Storm. Okay. Hey, okay. Do you guys understand that? Because I did not. Thanks. I said, what color do you want to get for Storm? And she said pink. Well, I didn't even see those. Are those large? Or medium. Large. So he needs medium and a large. Uh huh. So do you want to get the light pink too? Hi. <laughs> Fancy meeting you here again. Do you want to just get one more pair just in yeah. case so we have extras? Cause purple. She's purple. <laughs> She's got all her colors picked out. All right. It says here medium. Okay, so we have two mediums, two larges. Yep. Our boys are going to be looking fancy. So I'm getting pink. Two pinks. Diva. He's a diva. And then Tina gets purple, purple and yeah. orange. I love purple and orange. I'm getting this for and we'll save our other ones for extras. I'm getting this for Molly. Aw, you're so sweet. She'll like it. One weird thing about Molly is she never chews anything but her toys. Like, she lives for her toys. Okay, so then there's these ones. These but are these the ones. These ones don't spin around. Yeah. These ones are those, I like so they don't spin around. So I like these ones better, to be honest. These ones like are not that big and they're This is the brand that Chino has. I know, I don't love them. Like these, these ones are, are easier to wash. This, oh I have a kit just like that, but I'm not. Okay, look at Debbie's getting one of these to hang on her stall to hang her grooming box on. Go over the stall and then she can put her grooming box on it. Do you want one? I want pink. Pink. The girls both want this. Look. Yeah, it's cute. Come on, Maybe for Christmas. This. For Christmas. Look, Sophie, there's the lead rope that you were looking for. Oh my god, I, I need this. What color is his halter, though? It's purple. Then it won't match. No, our dog is good now. We trained her. Alright, we didn't train her that good. <laughs> she just learned it. Uh oh, don't touch her, don't touch her. Oh, sorry. Oh, Molly. Molly. Yeah, you gotta do that. Unfortunately, we didn't teach her that yet. <laughs> okay. We've been trying. She, if anybody pays attention to yeah. her, then... I always feel so mean. But oh, I know, I just... but... Ah! She's submitting, so that's good. She has a best friend, and she learned how to be a good friend. She's even a better friend to Holly than she is to... Houston? Houston. Oh, look at them. We need another Border Collie. Same energy. <laughs> They're like twins. Aww. Aww. That's amazing. I, I know. I really like I it. Look in the bag. 
All I see is pink and red. I know. It's almost like a sign that I'm getting a horse. Uh, try this, though. Do you, do you I like? I want to take my coat off. Well, I know, but if you want, I know I'm not buying something you don't try on. I'm always like, I'll buy you whatever you want. Just pick it. But they won't try anything on. That's cute. Gabby, look at this. Oh, this is adorable. It's a mountain horse. Gabby, your color. It's Chino's color. It is, it is not but look, it's got like the nice hood. It's not orange. It is orange. Like, I like a lot of clothes. I'd like to buy them clothes from the tax store. Wait, what's this? We like this because it's kind of fancy with this stitching. I can keep up with Poppy. That's way too big. Yeah. So these are the Noble Outfitter mud boots, which I love, except they're so narrow. Like they're hard to, right down in here, you can't get your foot in. I can never get my foot in. Do you want those? For winter? I these. No, I want the, hunters. You want, hunters aren't warm though. These are they warm. warm socks. Yeah, but they still aren't that warm. They'll freeze. But then they have the little ones. They're cute. Mom. Sophie wants a new helmet for Christmas. Can she wants a 1K. Can we do it a different day? Yeah, I we can go. I honestly want this. My kids can't shop for very long. Okay. What is that? My helmet? That's, oh, it's for your helmet, like a visor. It is. A, yeah, I want that too. Yeah, that's super cool. Yeah, that's Everybody cool. Everybody would make fun of me though. Yeah, they already do because of your wide brim. My lady helmet. Everybody says she looks like a fancy English lady. So, um, you guys saw, Molly is a really good dog. We only have one big struggle with her. What's the struggle? Toys. Not, no, not really the toys. What's our big struggle with her? I don't know. If you show any attention to, Mo to Molly, then you're out of luck. Like, she jumps on you like crazy. You have to ignore her or else she, like, she's very friendly with people and she wants to be right up in your face. I'm going to do a quick haul video because we're leaving this in the car so we can take it to the... Uh, burn tomorrow. Oh, we got Molly this toy. That's for you, Molly. She knows. She knows her toys. It's weird. Sophie bought her own thing. Um, I bought this grooming kit thing, which I love. We got four pairs of bell boots. Or we got boots. pink for Stormy Boy. She just has a pink. Don't lose my receipt if you want to put a stick right there. And then we got orange and purple for Chino. Yeah, like I said, somebody said put two pairs on them. We're gonna try it. Like, why not try it? And then we got. Uh, Gabby got, Sophie got a new lead rope. You always need a new lead rope going into a new season. We lose, lead, like, the thing of ours. We break, I yeah. break lead ropes. Yeah, lead ropes break the most of us, so we're always, like, lacking some. Although, if I clean the bar, which I'm planning to do, I'll probably find 17 of them. Gabby got a red one, Sophie got a fun one. Um, and then they both got one of these to hang on their locker so that um, they can hang their tack box on their lockers, or not on their locker, but on their stall. So all they have to do at night when we ride with Brandon is just walk in and start grooming. Here you go. So, so yeah, this week we've been to the bed tech store three times. So if you got two pairs of pants and a whole lot of treats, and then we also bought treats, salt lick. Um, imagine if we just I like bought fun. it all at one time and saved us the gas. I got a sponge. Yeah, we always need sponges too. And we have shows coming up. Oh, that's another thing, you guys. We actually have two shows coming up next weekend, not this weekend, next weekend. We have a hunter show. And then the next weekend after that, we have another hunter show. And then um, the day after that, there's a, there's a jumper show. And some of our friends are going to the jumper show. And so like Gabby really wants to go, but her horse is like not a jumper. And he's still, they're still My working on. Our horses are hunters. Yeah, our horses are hunters. But Finn, Finn could do jumping. So we're just trying to see, like, we might do all three. Uh, Sam is home from work now, so we were reunited. We were headed out to do some shopping, we left the girls at home. I told you I'm gonna show you that horse that Sam found for me. Get ready, get ready for it. There it is. Is it a mare? It's a mare. Gypsy. It's a gypsy banner, it's young. Isn't she cute? Doesn't it look like it would fit our house? It looks like the, her stripe is crooked, but it's just that her hair is hanging over. But she's so cute. I love her. 
bunch of people are telling me, don't give up the search. I'm not giving up the search. I have it out there. Brandon is looking for me. I'm looking for any gated horse. I talked to a lady at the barn yesterday. She had a gated horse there. She had a Tennessee, nope. She had a mountain, Rocky Mountain. Rocky Mountain gated horse, I think she said. Anyways, she loves her horse and I'm excited. I really definitely want a gated horse even though Sam found me a, um, even though Sam found me a beautiful gypsy. One day I'll have a gypsy, one day it'll be my dream. But I wanna really focus on a gated horse right now. Okay, we are home and Sam and I went to the P.O. box. One of our prizes came in for our giveaway. We have a bunch of stuff coming in. One came in. Can't wait to show you guys. Okay. So there's no letter, there's just this thing. So somebody sent Sophia a package and it says Miss Sophia. Isn't that amazing? Oh my God. This oh. is cookie on Oh, it's beautiful. Do you feel like crying? I kind of feel like crying. <laughs> She's got the tears. It says no longer by my side but forever in my heart and then it's got paw prints no longer by my side just wait let me show it no longer by my side but forever in my heart it's a keychain sophie it's so gorgeous and then it says I'm reading it. it's beautiful and it says best friend i love it i love it too thanks mel i need a bracelet now yeah, I think that'd be go great on a bracelet. It's hard for you guys to see it, but it says cookie. And then it says no longer by my side, but forever in my heart. And then the third one says best friends. That is beautiful. This person made a jolly ball. Oh, did did this it come with a different person? Oh, that's cute. Probably jolly. for your uh, Schleich. Average halter. Average size halter. I'm gonna play with Schleich now. And Sophie's like, ooh. Whips. Crops. That's not something somebody's ever made before. That's cool. Pony full halter with lead. Pony full halter with a lead rope. Green. Um, hook picks. Wow, that's incredible. They're so cool. Draft yeah. halter with lead. So maybe I'll fit Polly. So cool. Whip? Draft halter with lead. Pretty pink. Watermelon boots. Mm. Oh, polo wraps. Beautiful. Wow, whoever this is is super gifted. Okay, so somebody sent us a, oops, somebody sent us beautiful pictures of our horses and one of our logo. Oh, that's so cute. I love that. I call that for myself. You know what you could do with that? You could spray your spray on it and then put it in your car or hang it in your room or put it in your shoe or in your underwear drawer so everything smells nice. It says, my name is Abby. She's 12 years old and I'm such a big fan of all your videos. You are such a big inspiration to me. You have inspired me to do things I thought I would never do. Molly. Sometimes I'm sad. I tell myself to stay strong and ignore the mean. I have three horses and one of them is a cheeky Scotland like Willow. Oh, a cheeky, cheeky England person. A cheeky Shetland, sorry. One day I'm hoping I can come and see you when I visit family as I live in Wales. Please keep up the daily vlogs as I wait for the notification. You are all amazing. Bye. Oh, that's so nice, Abby. That is so nice. Thank you for all your pictures. And I love this. I like to know how you make that because these would be really no, fun. You just cut out cardboard and wrap it around. Yeah, we should do that. So the girl that sent the Schleichs named Arden, and she says that she's in grade seven. She rides at a stable near Kingston, Ontario. So she's close to us. I'm older uh, than her. Wow, Gabby, you win. You're older than her. Uh -huh. um, I'm too lazy to search through it all. Sophie's already got her, her Schleich down here, oh, Arden. She's getting all ready to play. <laughs> you inspired her to play. Well, when I get new Schleich stuff, uh, she says she feels a connection to us because of our close location, so that's super cool. I watch all your videos, but I especially love the show vlog ones. I volunteer at my stables riding camp. I love seeing be beginners grow their skills. Okay, first of all, how do you get these small bags? 
Yeah, where do you get those small bags? I thought it was gonna be small for him, but it fits perfectly. Now what we're gonna do. Isn't that so cute? Anyway, that is it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll be back at it tomorrow with a whole busy weekend. Holy heck, we have a busy weekend. Don't you know that you're beautiful? Just the